Hello, oh, I'm in the kitchen today. I wanted to show you something kind of neat for your iPad. Uh, the Joy of Cooking just came out with an app. Obviously, uh, we like to cook at our house. We have uh, lots of books. So here we have the app. I'll just give you a little tour. And you know, it's got everything arranged by like um, sections over here. So you got like drinks and so if, if this is the way you want to go through a cookbook like you would through a table of contents, um, that's how you would do it. You can also uh, bookmark your favorite uh, recipes. I haven't done much of that yet. And this is kind of a, a handy feature right here. Um, if you see a recipe and you want to know what to get, you can um, put yourself together a little shopping list. You can plan entire menus with that button. And down in this corner, um, there's uh, converters for all the different measurements and things and then a uh, cooking timer so you can right down here you can start a timer and it'll keep track of all that for you now let's say you want to uh, find a recipe for macaroni and cheese so you just go up here to search you can type in macaroni and uh, I'll, I'll click on uh, recipes and it'll give me uh, all kinds of different recipes. I'm going to try the baked mac and cheese. Ooh, it's thundering out. And I'm actually going to make this tonight. Um, so it, it tells you all the different things that uh, you're going to need, how to do it. And then uh, if it calls for another recipe like this one calls for making white sauce, um, you just click the, the little hyperlink and it'll take you right to that recipe. To go back, you just click back. And then everything is described in like great detail. Uh, how to do all of this. And since I like this, I'm going to bookmark it. I'm going to add it to my favorites. You can bookmark it. Um, and let's see, maybe this is a way to share it. Oh yeah, hey, check this out. You can mail it to yourself, you can print it. You can make a little menu and all that. It's really pretty slick. Another cool thing is, you know, anything that you're going to need uh, for the recipe is listed over here. Um, you know, you can go through steps and figure out all these different things and then the ingredient list. And this is how you would add it to your shopping list. Um, right here you just click add all and then you'd have a shopping list that you could print and take with you. If you wanted to do that, um, I already have all this stuff. The other cool thing is, is that we can use this right here in the kitchen. Of course my power just went out because some lightning struck my transformer or something. but. Um, you use it right in the kitchen while you're cooking to refer back to stuff. Uh, say you're at work and you just get all hungry for something like, oh, I don't know, like say like a burrito or something. So, uh, and you don't you don't remember exactly what what to get and all that, or you want a falafel sandwich, say, um, and you you can't remember what to get. And so you know you can you can just pull this up. I pretty much always have my iPad with me, and uh, pull it up, get all your stuff together, uh, go to the grocery store, get your stuff, and uh, not forget a thing. So that's it. Wish me luck with the power. Uh, I'd just throw it in a Dutch oven, but it's kind of raining. Um, we'll see.